want to talk to people tonight who maybe feel things are hopeless, dreams have been shattered, things look dark. Tonight we want to declare to you it's not over. It's only the beginning. Sing it, Newbury. But death will be destroyed forever, and the Lord God will wipe away every tear from every face. In the past, all of his people were sad, but God will take away that sadness from the earth. All of this will happen because the Lord said it would. Thanks be to God. Good morning, brothers and sisters. The theme of the chapter that Isaiah 25 verse 8 is in is God's banquet for his servants. This year has been a tough year for me and my family with regards to all the family deaths we've had. In April it was my auntie Sheila, end of June was Denzel Peterson, our friend, Two weeks later, Dion van der Merwe, a friend of ours. And then a week later, my aunt, Bev, my mother's sister. And two weeks later, her daughter, my cousin. They all died from COVID. Just as we were thinking life was returning to normal, we had to pray and trust God for his will to be done in the life of my stepmother, Connie as she was battling with pancreatic cancer. This verse I've considered in the context of the people that's left behind after all these deaths, the families, the friends. But in the scripture, God promises us that he'll wipe away every tear, he'll remove the sadness and that we must trust in him. So I'd like to encourage you with the thought, surely this is our God. We trusted in him and he saved us. This is the Lord we trusted in him. Let us rejoice and be glad in his salvation. In Jesus name, Amen. Lord Jesus, thank you for our health, thank you for our livelihood, and thank you for everything you have blessed us with. Today we pray especially for those who are mourning the loss of a loved one. You promise in Isaiah 
that you will wipe away every tear. Today we bring our sorrow and our loneliness to you, Lord. You are our salvation and we will always put our trust in you. In Jesus' name, Amen. I feel this thing pushing in the room. Not over. Somebody came into the building suicidal. Not over. Somebody came into the building thinking this is a last day. Not over. And you're going to be able to stand in that relationship. Somebody came with a report from the doctor that's got you all tied up. This whole night has suddenly been stopped to tell you when God is in it. Oh, when God is in it. Somebody shout, when God is in it. Shake somebody next to you. I know, I know, I know it's...